What's good? You know, uh, I'm gonna come at y'all. This ain't, it's game, but it ain't nothing I really would just say. Uh, I would, I would rather, you know, write it down and wait for y'all to hear it. This is just something I was thinking about on the way. Cause something made me think about it on two different levels. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is why I thought about it over some dominoes and shit. So me, you know what I'm talking about? We all give player points and you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to tell you something hardly anybody do. I want to say hardly, but I've never seen nobody do it, which I understand in a way, but I'm going to tell y'all how we can fix that. Everybody that rep, ain't nobody better than me. I'm cold when you say that. I understand. I mean, everybody will say it, but I'm the type of cat. I'm not, okay, well, let me rephrase this. And I did say this part on the song. If a person's real in that rap and he really, really, really for real, I'm not better than that person and that person isn't better than me. Now, I did say that, but what I meant to say is and going that far, because I, I be playing dominoes on my phone. And when I come across playing them experts, I get my ass kicked because I'm not an expert domino player. That's just for real. I can, I can win certain ones. Sometimes I rarely win with experts. It's like I really got to, it's like them motherfuckers make me concentrate. And I win with other ordinary people like me. But I was kind of thinking as in somebody said, let's play for money. And I told them, I ain't no expert. I'm not going to be stupid and play an expert for some money knowing you. You nine times out of ten in the loop. Okay, an expert and domino player, what I meant. And this is what made me bring this up. I was thinking about it. Playing him, it's like a person wanting to battle me i'm an expert in i'm an expert in i ain't gonna say rap music i could put music i could put rap to country rock i can do rock i can do poetry i'm so cold at that shit but i don't look at myself as i'm better than everybody i just look at myself as you got these fake ass rappers and all this and that yeah hell yeah i'm better than them i mean shit that's a fact but when it comes to cats, that's like everybody that's real. You could be, you could be barely just coming in the game today, ain't got shit out. But you finna go to the studio tomorrow. If you real, I ain't better than you, and you ain't better than me. But I'ma give you a key note on something like this. I'ma tell you how play I am about this. If you heard my song Heart and Rhythm, Lucky Little. If you ask me, he killed it. He was better than my verse. And if I'd have known he was going to come that cold, I'd have made him go first and I go second. Because the way that boy was spitting, how cold he was, we could have put that on country channels. We could have put that on rock channels because my verse was just something. I mean, people that, that listen to country and rock and this and that, they listen to me. But what I was saying, you don't, what I was saying, that's not something they want to hear. I talk about all kind of stuff. But what Lucky said on that song, they would have really listened to it for him unless they know me, of course. Then that's a different story. Cause they would have put it to you like this. If they know me, they'd have been like, yeah, his verse was all right, but that's not, you know, something they want to hear. They want to hear all the other shit I bring to them. That's how I play I am about it, and that's how I look at it. You know, um, I'm just telling you, I'm kind of bringing it to you on a level nobody brought it as. Because, of course, when the person say nobody can do it, like blah, 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 blah. They know we we ain't. I mean, they know they ain't hating. I know they ain't hating, but shit, it's like I say, ain't none of us. We all cold on this motherfucker, unless you get this fake ass rapper. He got a fake mentality to begin with. He or she. I mean, that's when they might as well not come in the game. But when you want to talk about some professional shit, oh yeah, I get down on that microphone. And if you're listening to me, you already know I'm cold than a motherfucker. And my album, give it time because I'm trying to take time and make it perfect because it's not going to be a mixtape. We're not doing no more mixtapes. And so I'm trying to have that shit be just super duper bomb. And if it happened, like I think, I'm going to have a rock song on there. I'm going to be on a country beat. We talking about original shit. I'm talking about this motherfucker gonna be so dope. Now, when you want to talk about music, we ain't talking about dominoes. We talking about music. Oh, I'm a professional. I ain't no producer, but I'm an artist. I rap. I, I, I do rock. I do poetry. 
I got portrait that's gonna be on there too. Yes, I'm a professional when it comes to that. And I really don't battle. Last time somebody tried to pretend it was a battle, they lost. You ever seen 8 Mile? You know how when Eminem grabbed that mic and he was... That's all I'm gonna say. But you know what I'm saying? I don't believe in battling. That ain't for me. I never believed in battling. Anytime you hear me dissing somebody, I'm dead serious. Fuck a battle, I'm dead serious. That's how, that, That's what it is. But I just decided to, to share this game with y'all. I hope y'all had a nice Thanksgiving. Me, the album coming, I'm just, I'm, I'm experimenting. One minute I say I'm going to do an EP, a six song. Then I say I'm going to do this. I'm going to drop a single, which I'm not going to drop a single the way I plan now. I'm just, look here. I think I'm going to take my time with this, so don't think something happened. I left, because y'all used to me dropping shit every three months. I take my time with this and put it out there like that, you gonna hear, you gonna hear some good shit. See, when I, mine, I don't know if it's your favorites, my favorites is always how I do it. And my, every time I say this when I did is my favorite, I didn't do it on purpose. So I really don't know if it's gonna be my favorite, it might, might not, I gotta wait till I finish and just hear it and just see how it flow. That's part of a good order, well, I ain't gonna say good, that's part of a, I guess good artists, yeah, I mean a good artist in many ways. You know, sometimes you don't do things on purpose, it just happened that way. You all have a nice day? You have a, um, well, I mean, in a way I believe in Thanksgiving, I guess I could say have a happy Thanksgiving, I hope everybody's doing okay, I hope everybody, shit, this corona shit we're dealing with, hope y'all doing okay with that, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, alright y'all, let me, I'm gonna watch this DJ Screw movie, I see, oh, if y'all don't know, DJ Screw Movie is on here on YouTube. I'm finna watch it again. I watched it one time. This is gonna be my second time. I watched it the first night it came out. That was like two or three weeks ago. But you know, the, the kind of things I'm dealing with, I didn't want to watch it every day, but I'm kind of in the mood to just watch that motherfucker. Nah, you know what I'm talking about? Because um, it's, it's, it's pretty good. I respect what Lil Kiki say. If you watch it, if you ain't seen it, you'll see what I mean with Lil Kiki say. Just kind of, you know, bear with him so I can bear with him. I ain't going to, I'll just say it's, it's pretty good. You know what I'm saying? I respect what Lil Kiki said in the beginning. And so, that's all I got to say. You all have a night. And if you don't know, it's called All Screwed Up. You can watch the movie right now.